I noticed tears in the eyes of several members of the audience. So we're getting one or two people with the 80s icons brought to you tonight by Bar Pack. Absolutely correct. And one or two people getting it wrong. People who getting it wrong were Pete. He thought it was Christopher Timothy. Christopher Timothy. I think he was in uh, All Creatures Great and Small, wasn't he, Vittnery? But no, it's not him. Big John, he thinks it's Percy Sugden. Percy Sugden. And Little John, Big John and Little John, I like it. He doesn't have a clue. I noticed tears in the eyes of several members of the audience. But we've got a few people who do know who the 80s icon is. Rob the Dormouse, as ever. Well done to you, sir. You are correct. Wendy's got it right as well, so it must be easy. Ali's got it correct, but no Phil tonight. She's on her own. But well done, Ali. You've got it right. Marco as well. Good evening, Marco. Nice to hear from you. I haven't heard from you for a long, long time. Nice to know that you're back on duty. And Metal Mickey, well done to you, sir. You've got it right. And one more which has popped up on the text, and that is Barraby Steve. Yes, Barraby Steve, he has it correct as well. I noticed tears in the eyes of several members of the audience. You've led astray from your It's a tune. It's Alison Moye and Love Letters, and we like that one down here at the studio. And we also like this one as well. Can never remember playing it, actually. But it is to Rob the Dormouse, it is Genesis, and it's Illegal Alien. And yes, it's his traditional five-minute-plus song. Go and put the kettle on. Genesis from 1983, an illegal alien, a nice long one for Rob. Oh, indeed it was. My word, that was the quickest two minutes I've ever experienced in my life, but guess what, I did it. I noticed tears in the eyes of several members of the audience. And that's a good one, Rob the Dormouse, I like your one. Yes, just shout, Heidi High, just shout, Heidi High. Well, I can do better than that, actually, because I've worked feverishly away during that last two minutes, and we have got the easy piece of clue for tonight's 80s icon, which is brought to you by Bar Pack. Now, we know that David, Alex, Anna and Melvin, they thought it was Bernard Manning you might need to listen Dirty Den you need to listen because you thought it was Les Dawson along with Little John and Geordie Big John thinks it's Percy Sugden and Pete thinks it's Christopher Timothy the rest of you you all know the correct answer so it is an easy piece of clue for tonight's 80s icon it was Heidi High where he played the camp host but you might remember him in You Rang My Lord the most it was Heidi High where he played the camp host, but you might remember him in You Rang My Lord the most, I have to say. Ooh, I've given away. Under pressure. Well, how about that? This day, 1981, it was number one, Queen and David Bowie, and Under Pressure. And it is everything 80s, with me, Marcus Wesley, in the hot seat for another 30 minutes. And let's get back to the story about Casanova Sai and Trevor Francis. The only time he's ever scored, well, Rob the Dormouse has been on the phone. He tells us that he entered into such a competition which was very like that. But the goalkeeper was Eric McManus. Yes, the ex Notts County goalkeeper. He was about age 10. And Rob the Dormouse, he came runner-up. Can you believe it? Runner-up. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is what put him off football for life. Keep holding. You keep holding on. Keep holding. You keep holding on. You keep holding. You keep holding on. There we go. Tinchy's right over there. You're not alone. You've got four minutes to get your answers in to tonight's star on the dance floor. Okay, then this one's going out to Robbie. Wants this one, Olive. You're not alone. See where you're coming from now, Rob. That's Olive, you're not alone. That was Rob's choice tonight. Start on the dance floor. OK, then, reveal the answer then. Let's have a recap on the clues. Born the 27th of January 1972. He's an English singer-songwriter. Is always on a four-minute warning. Well done to Sarah Gemma. And finally, Rob the Dormouse worked out who it was. He named, all, he named four of them, but forgot the fifth member. And well done to Mel for that. And everybody down at the skipping. All guess at tonight's star on the dance floor was none other than Mark Owen. Is this the end, 
Okay, then, let's put you out your miseries and reveal the answer to your midnight mashup. Only Rob of Dormouse guessing what it was, artist and song title he got right. That's what it sounds like when it's all mashed up. If you blow really hard at your radio speakers, it will flip and knit back together and play right for you. On the count of three, blow very hard. One, two, three. 